This is Stephanie Schubke from the German Heart Center in Munich, and we're here at the ESC Congress in Paris, where I just presented the ISOREAC-5 trial. ISOREAC-5 is a heart-to-heart comparison of Ticaglo versus Prazeril in acute coronary syndromes. Why did we design the trial? Both Ticaglo and Prazeril have received a class one recommendation for their use in acute coronary syndrome patients. And what was unclear were the relative merits of these drugs. We really wanted to perform a hat to hat comparison in the whole spectrum of acute coronary syndrome patients regarding one-year clinical outcomes. And therefore, we designed this investigator-initiated, randomized, multi-center, open-label trial. We enrolled a total of 4,018 patients in 23 centers and assigned them to either a Takagalo-based or Prasugil-based strategy. We assumed that Takagalo would be superior to Prasugil for the primary endpoint of all-cause death, myocardial infarction or stroke at one year after randomization. And the safety endpoint was bleeding bark type 3 through 5. However, contrary to our expectation, we found that Prasugil is superior to Takagalo. And importantly, this increased efficacy did not occur at the expense of an increased bleeding risk. ISOREC-5 not only compared to drugs, but also to strategies, that is pretreatment versus no pretreatment in non-ST elevation acute coronary syndromes. Based on the ACOST trial, which has shown that pretreatment with prasugil in non-ST elevation myocardial infarction does not provide benefit in terms of ischemic events, but significantly increases um, TIMI major bleeding, Pretreatment with prasugil in this setting is not recommended. While we have no head to head comparison for pretreatment versus no pretreatment with Ticagalor, based on the design and results of the PLATO trial, it is recommended in the guidelines to use Ticagalor if pretreatment is intended. So we use this strategy pretreatment with Ticagalor and no pretreatment with Prasugil in non ST elevation acute coronary syndrome based on the available evidence and current recommendations. So the ISO REACT 5 trial showed that this Prasugil based strategy with no pretreatment in non ST elevation acute coronary syndrome patients is superior to a Ticagalor based strategy and should therefore become the first-line antiplatelet regimen in these patients.